hello hello my friends sorry about the mess but this is what i'm working right now because i'm kind of reorganizing things and see if i can reduce some of the space since i keep pretty much everything in the orig original packaging due to uh, that due to lack of space so um uh, these are all my punch board from We Are Memory Keeper. And this is what I've been doing now. Um, I have these uh, dish um, organizers um, for cabinets and they're vintage. I found them. Um, I want to use those. And yeah, I'm taking everything out of the packaging and I'm putting everything in there. See how everything looks um over there i'm sorry that i moved the camera so fast this is my cord for my creek cut but over there those two um i think the cord is going to be in the way let's see over there those two containers over there are notebooks and like um stationary type of notebook type thing you know deal so i have those two already organized ready to go ready to be to be somewhere where i really don't know yet but yes they are getting near that's uh my old cart and all what i have there as you guys can see it's my papers and in the bottom i have um charms and glass beads and stuff like that but yeah i have this huge mess here i'm trying to figure out what to do um hopefully this work um the instructions that came with my um uh these instructions that came with each of the uh punch boards um i'm putting in this a book that i made um long time ago that it was meant to be for uh, stickers. This is where um, you see where I'm being put in them. So I know, you know, in case I have to reference to those instructions, they're gonna be here and they're gonna be over here with the um, punch boards. So once I'm done with that, I will show you guys how this shell will look. Uh, stay tuned for that. Okay, my friends, um, I'm back here. Uh, to show you and to share with you guys um, how I organize all my punch board from We Are Memory Keepers. All that is just the punch boards. Um, I did have um, every single one of them in their original packaging uh, because up to today, that was something that was working for me, even though I always want to organize them uh, on this way. I'm like a very fan of uh, We Are Memory Keepers uh, products, uh, especially tools. And I think they're very helpful. They're very easy to understand. And that's why I just went a little bit out of control and get all these um we are memory creepers um punch boards and stuff um i know they did just recently came out with uh like a tool that does like maybe 12 to 14 different things um things that you can do with a lot of these here that I'm going to change. No, I'm not gonna get that too. I already have these ones and uh, it's going to be pretty much the same thing. So I'm gonna keep this one. I'm not gonna, you know, get rid of this to get the new one. That's something that is not gonna happen, at least not for now. And yes, it will be nice because I will have more space, but then I'll be losing money at the long you know because nobody gonna give me the amount of money that i pay for this and i have to say pretty much all these you know it, they came from um tuesday morning but still like uh i think the less that i did pay was like maybe nine dollars for some of the items so you know if you put ten dollars 
each people don't gonna probably that they don't gonna give me that kind or type of money anyway that being said that they are organized now um i got my square uh punch board over there um my uh big envelope punch board my box uh punch board my three three to one uh tool it does the bows it does the boxes it does um envelopes i believe also i have the box to uh one that i have the scotting board and, and the um trimmer um i have this one it's uh martha store but um i'm gonna put it there because um that's the only one and two over here there are these two these are crafter companions and that is an envelope maker and a card maker and um yeah but the rest of it this is like my mini guillotine paper trimmer um yeah you know i have all of them here here i have my happy jig it's in this envelope with some of the um the wire uh this one here it's my word uh punch i um, was using that for a couple of projects so yeah but that's that's how my organization looks sorry i apologize for that um and it, it does work and then um the this here this um binder here these will gonna have my instructions for the punch boards i put them in there um you guys see for every single one of them i have the instructions here uh why i keep the instructions because yes because i'm crazy like that and i can forget things or you know measurements i i won't be able to memorize you know every single thing about these tools so that's why and i'm sorry that it's like a little bit you know to the side but um that's the best way that i can um make you guys to see these Oop, my feet there <laughs> but yes um that's how you know i store everything in here all the booklets with instructions anything they bring even for my um crafter crafter companions ones so i put them in here and i put a couple extra of these uh white pages in case you know I get more tools i can you know um go ahead and um get and the instructions and put it there in the binder but yeah this is how it looks i just want to share with you guys how i organize my uh we are memory keepers uh punch boards and tools and yeah, thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys like the video. If you guys have any questions or any comments, leave them down below. And I will be seeing you in the next video. Bye-bye now.